Hey guys, welcome to another video here on Steep Country Outdoors. Today, took some of the elk sheds that we found this past fall out in the elk woods. And uh, they're the browns from last year, so they would have been fully brown in spring, but they were a little more faded out when we found them in the fall. So we're gonna take some boiled linseed oil today, and we're gonna bring some of the natural color back and just kind of restore the elk shed antlers, you could say. Um, so come along. Here's all the sheds that we found this fall. Um, we got three different six points that we found. Here was probably the nicest one we found. We actually chased this bull that I'm holding right here. We, he had the same exact frame except his back end and his back forks were bigger, so that was nice. This one here is super heavy. He's really short, but heavy. Stubby, he's a stubby six point, he's really nice. And yeah, this is just a kind of a baby standard six point. So. Nice, nice antlers we found this fall. We also did kill our elk, which was a great, and so anyway. So we got a quarter boiled linseed oil here. You can get this on Amazon. It's like 13 or 14 bucks. We'll put a link in the description box below if you want to get some. So I just poured some of that linseed oil into an empty jar just to make it easier. And we got some rags here too. Now these rags are going to get soaked with linseed oil. Linseed oil in a rag crumpled up will spontaneously combust. So when you're done, you always want to like lay it out on the concrete or lay it out on the rocks and let it dry before you throw it away or anything like that. So I'm just going to take some of this linseed oil and these are, you know, they're faded a little bit, but I think we're going to be able to bring the color back without having to use potassium permanate or stain or anything like that. Yeah. So I'm just going to take a little bit of this. I'm going to dip this brush in here and we're just going to paint it on with the brush all over the whole antler and then we're gonna rub it around with a rag. There you have it guys. This is just a little antler preservation for these shed antlers that we picked up this last fall. Um, if you were wanting to color them or something like that, you can use the potassium permanate or anything like that. But this is just to preserve the color that they had left in them and kind of bring back that natural color that stands out more um, with the linseed oil. Um, and don't forget, take these rags throw them out in the concrete or in the rocks and let them dry out same with the brushes let them dry out before you throw them in the trash yeah highly combustible guys so we don't want anyone to have anything catch on fire by accident but like we said the boiled linseed oil that's the amazon link is down in the description box below you can go check that out if you want to preserve your antlers like this um, they're going to dry now probably just overnight just to be safe and they should dry with a nice matte finish you know so they look natural and they don't look shiny or anything but and also the boiled linseed oil it's also used for wood stocks and knife handles and all kinds of stuff i always have it around like you said little antler preservation thanks for watching the video if you haven't already please make sure you subscribe and if you're subscribed already we appreciate it it helps us out a lot and until the next video guys we'll see you